guys! Woo! Today I'm going to be talking about my favorite Christmas books. But I just want to show you some cute stuff. That's Frosty. He's cute. Over here we have Rudolph with Hello Kitty riding him. So kinky. Okay. Then up there we have the Grinch. And a crocheted painting. Or knit painting. I know it's one of the two. Um, my Winter Warlock Candles by Victoria and that wax church I keep showing you that you're probably sick of seeing. So I'm just going to get into my favorite books and some of them are like kitty and some of them are like regular books. So the first one I'm going to talk about is The Handmaid and the Carpenter and if you are with Keeping Christ in Ki Christmas in Christmas. If you are with Keeping Christ in Christmas, you'll probably appreciate this book because it's the story of Mary and Joseph and how like she had to be like dude I didn't sleep with anybody else I really am just like pregnant out of nowhere so that it's a really good book and it's the story of Christmas so why not and it's a good book next is like my all-time favorite and it's the snowman and oh I'm sorry the handmaid and the carpenter is by Elizabeth Berg and she's a New York Times best-selling author and the snowman is by Raymond Briggs and basically there's no words it's just these cute little comments well there I don't think there's words on this I know they made a movie about it but it's just like I remember my favorite picture is him with a cup of soup is that it is he ever having soup how pretty is that and look I wrote my name on it like a brat when I was little so I've had this for a really long time oh look it's, I got it for Christmas. Dear Emily, Merry Christmas, honey. Love always, mom, dad. XOXO, 1992. So, I was one years old when I got this book. So, it's in pretty good condition, I guess. I mean, it still has a front page. But I wish I could find the soup picture. Unless I was just dreaming that he had soup. Hold on. Give me a spec. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think maybe there wasn't soup. <sighs> but they did have dinner. Maybe that's what I got confused about. But whatever. The Snowman is such a great book. And it's not just for kids. It's fun and just cozy to look at. So I really like The Snowman. Next book, A Little House Christmas. I love this book. It's like recipes and stories from the Little House books. Like if you know like... Little House on the Prairie. It has cute pictures and like it's just really cute. And I think I got this for Christmas. Oh look, I wrote my name in it again. You're such a brat. I wrote my name in a lot of stuff. So I'm trying to find a recipe. See this this like short story. It's called Mr. Edward Meets Santa Claus. So that's kind of cute. I'm trying to find a recipe. Look at that tree. It just says it's cute for kids. Like, I had this when I was a kid. Um, I don't see any recipes. So, either I'm, like, really slow or... Okay, so there's, like, music, like, for the piano. Which I don't, like, play piano anymore, but... Alright, I can't find a recipe. So, whatever. It's just got a bunch of short stories. And, yeah. It's cute. 